Okay, so a friend told me that he could not find a video anywhere on YouTube on how to test a fluorescent light ballast. Um, I have two of them here, um, and we'll go ahead and give them a test. Now on your multimeter, what you're going to want to do is go to your ohms, go to like your 4K setting. Um, you may have 1K or 2K, but definitely stay within the 1,000 range, 1,000 ohms. And then take your black clip. Go ahead and hook it. We'll test this front ballast first here. I've got all the wires kind of brought up so we can just test them right here. Go ahead and hook your black from your meter to the white wire. It's kind of hard to see the contrast there, but that's our white wire against the others. Now while that's hooked up, what you want to do is connect your other test lead to the wires and see if your meter still reads open line. Um, it should read open line open line. Um, if you have an analog meter it should not move. It, I'm sorry, if you have an analog meter it should jump all the way over it. It should show maximum resistance basically is what you're looking for. There shouldn't be any connection between the white wire and your other wires of the ballast. So here we go to test the blue and you see that it actually shows us there's barely any resistance. That's that's bad. It should say open line. Once again, we see on our reds here. It says open line on our yellows too. But on our blues, it definitely shows going dropping way down. That's that's not good. So we tested that one. We'll take our other one here. Get our connector back. Connect our black to our white wire here. And then you're going to go ahead and once again test the rest of these on this ballast. Hook up to them for a second. And so that ballast is good. That's more than likely why someone had it kept nice and neat. Um, but that is how you test a fluorescent bulb ballast. Hope this helps, guys.